Right, tell the other champs. Now, this thing here is the Oris RTX 3080 gaming box, and this thing packs a punch. It is actually the world's first water-cooled Thunderbolt 3 or Thunderbolt 4. It works on Thunderbolt 4. Check that eGPU. And you can see it here hooked up to this absolute monster of a laptop, this Aura 17G. This laptop is special. It not only has an RTX 3080, it has an awesome mechanical keyboard, and that's what separates it. That's what makes it so special. But anyway, we're here to talk about this RTX 3080 powered eGPU. Yes, that's right. It has a full fat RTX 3080 in it. And I did take off the panels just to have a quick look. Yes, it is indeed water-cooled and it is a true RTX 3080 made by Gigabyte, so you know it's good. Now, the guy that sent this out, Alex, is an absolute cool dude. He has his own YouTube channel. And if you're into PC gear, you want to subscribe to this guy's channel. Has amazing content, has amazing products on there, amazing PC builds. I'll leave a link in the description. But have a look at this thing. It's got the cool RGB on the front, the Aorus logo. On the back, we have two HDMI 2.1s, three Display Ports 1.4, I guess, a reset button, Ethernet. You have the Thunderbolt port, two USB 3.0s and their Type-A, and the fan and the power. And that's as simple as it gets. And look how small it is compared to my clunker, all right? It's so much more compact, matte black. And this is something you're not going to upgrade or whatever over time. This is just a set and forget, easy plug and play. You don't have to mess about with it like my eGPU. And it actually comes with the three carry bag. And that would actually be good for a few beers in there as well, that carry bag. It looks like it's well insulated. So if you have a Thunderbolt 3 or Thunderbolt 4 port, you can use this to turbocharge your system. It doesn't really make sense on this Aorus laptop unless you're going to be using something that uses multi-GPUs, like some you know, sort of calculation, scientific work, or create an app that actually does use multiple GPUs. Because gaming-wise, when you have a 1380 and an Aorus 17G, because of the bottleneck of Thunderbolt, the external Thunderbolt is not going to be faster, even though it has a full fat RTX 3080. Although if you have an older laptop, you know, 10 series, 20 series, or even one of the low end like maybe a 3060 or probably beat some of the 3070s if you want to turbocharge a system this is a good thing to look at now you can see it here even with my mac of all things a mac if you want to see a video on a mac with a 3080 connected to it what's it perform like laptop and you know imac as well let me know down there in the comments i will do that i've already done videos on an eGPU and an rtx 3080 and 3090 you can 4k game with this box no problem whatsoever okay so you know it's not going to perform any better or worse than any other Thunderbolt enclosure, Thunderbolt 3 enclosure, eGPU. But what you need to know, it is a full fat, full performing RTX 3080. Now, when it comes to using it, the only thing I'll say in terms of noise is it's around 46 decibels to 48 sitting where you would sit from where your laptop is or whatever you've got it connected to. So about 46 decibels under full load. If you go right up to it, you know, put the decibel meter up there, it can be up to 56 decibels under full load but you're never going to be that close to it so it's not like silent you'll be able to hear it if you've got a headset on probably not but in a quiet room you will hear it under full load the idle noise you don't have to worry about that heat it's water cooled it doesn't get overly hot or anything like that it doesn't throttle it's just a great you know box hook it up to your laptop or desktop with thunderbolt nice and compact water cooled gives you full performance there some enclosures actually throttle down your you know gpu if it's not you know well ventilated this one here it's good it's got the power supply built in you don't have to worry what you know wattage the power supply is because it's just a sealed unit right you're not going to be touching it in that regard so anyway i'll catch you in the next one guys Tally ho.